All right, what's up guys? Migmatis Golf. Uh, big shout out to Zen Golf. I think it's Zen Golf. Anyway, check them out. Quick little uh, project. Got this idea from uh, the chap at Zen Golf. Uh, he has two training devices that are really valuable and I've just kind of uh, done it on steroids. I've put them both together and uh, come up with a fantastic training aid. So let's make this short. Let's get to it. Very simple. Piece of three quarter plywood. That thing is 30 inches long by 12 and a half wide. Don't worry about the holes. Those are just mounting holes for these self explanatory. These are Lazy Susans. It's, you see, it's like ball bearings in there. One thing turns on top of the others. Link in the description for Amazon for these. All the dimensions will also be in the description. So that's three quarter inch plywood, half inch plywood, two circles cut out, 10 and a half inches in diameter. Those are gonna go on top of these guys. And spin, right. You might ask, why have I routed the edges of everything? Well, that's just because I have the tools. It's pretty. No, seriously, uh, you know, you got to be on this possibly barefoot. So just to get all the sharp edges off, should you slip? Uh, so tools, if you've got them, you can do all this. This has taken me half an hour so far. I'm going to paint it and I still have a stick to mount on the underside of here. So this will rock like a seesaw. When it's finished, I'll show you, you'll get the picture. All in all, it's probably gonna take me an hour to build. If you skip a lot of the beautifying process, it could probably be done in half an hour. Super cheap. Anyway, dimensions, um, links, everything in the description. And once it's all put together and it's got a lick of paint, I'll show it to you and uh, demo it. Fantastic. All right, following on. On the underside, got a bit of uh, inch and an eighth dowel. Doesn't really matter. You can use inch and a quarter, inch and a half, even inch. But cut in half. If you can't do that, just use a square piece of timber. It doesn't really make that much difference. So that is right across the middle, glued to the underside, and we'll screw it in from above as well. Ooh, it's all coming together. All right, guys, here we go. The Zen board is finished. You can see it down here. So it's just one of those seesaw boards, which you've seen before, but I have juiced it up. I've juiced it up with these Lazy Susan turntables. And what this training device allows you to do is it allows you to properly practice transferring your weight so good balance required transferring the weight before you put any rotational motion in so lateral motion you can hear the snap lateral motion rotational motion you need a bit of lateral motion first just a tiny bit it's almost like a pressure change not a weight change pressure change then the club comes through. I have a tendency actually to spin my hips. I can feel myself doing it. Interesting. Okay, so that's why it's important. I am going to now show you the benefits of this Frankenstein. And that is its modular. So the one I saw on the channel Zen Golf was a balance board like this, but then kind of like this, another board with these like turntables added on top of it. Whereas this is all in one and it's modular, which means I can remove these very simply. So if I don't want to practice with these, just use the balance board on its own, or maybe just use one if you're working on like your left hip turning or your right hip turning. 
so there we go that is why this is a fantastic training aid i think on amazon the uh, turntables or the lazy susans were about 15 dollars I don't know, there's about five bucks worth of other materials there. So for $20, you get a fantastic training aid. I'm calling it the Zen board, just to give credit where credit is due. I'll leave all the uh, links to Zen Golf Channel and all the dimensions and everything in the description. And you can go make yourself one of these super, super valuable training aid. Down the line, photo. So there you go, fantastic little training aid. Takes a while to get used to, but uh, for under $20, um, fantastic value. All right, so that's it. Please tell all your friends about the channel. Uh, give us a thumbs up, please subscribe. Leave some comments if you've got one of these or you've had a similar idea. Anything else you want to say? Um, oh, and I have a channel. It's called um, The Candy Thief. Please go check it out now. And um, so, yeah, please subscribe. See ya.